Uh, get to know you a bit better. How about telling us why did you sign up for the Sumatra Challenge? Well, I actually was online looking up different charities because I did want to do something to support a charity that I am strongly linked with and I happened to come across this on the Body Shop Foundation website. Um, it supports the uh, critically endangered orangutan and also the rainforests that are being cut down which obviously contribute to global warming and also our quality of air. So those are all things that I I am uh, very passionate about. So I decided to sign up for the challenge also because it involves trekking, which I love doing, and uh, going into the jungle to do something a little bit tough. And uh, I've had to do a lot of fundraising over the past uh, six months, so I've been really busy with that as well. So what have you done for fundraising? Tell us about that. Fundraising, I've done quite a bit and actually with a lot of support actually from my colleagues and friends. So had a Mexican night at my house where we had uh, lots of tacos and margaritas and all that, all the money going to uh, the Orangutan Foundation and also did a, a very successful garage sale where everyone donated all kinds of stuff um, and of course sold the stuff and made a lot of money uh, through that and also a product sale at the body shop and um, of course sponsorship that's really been really important so people have sponsored me for the trek i am going to be roughing it going through some tough terrain and leeches are a possibility all those things so uh, so thanks for everyone who has supported me as well so it all sounds very exciting and it's happening very soon are you what are you looking forward to and are you nervous about anything at all mm, looking forward to just being in the jungle and do and actually getting to meet some orangutans. I will be re, uh, visiting the rehabilitation center, so I will get a chance to see the orangutans, also hopefully in the wild. And um, yeah, just getting a bit closer with nature. I do love trekking. Uh, it's not something that uh, is foreign to me, trekking. I, I've done a lot, but you can never, you can never be too cautious as well because, I mean, nature can throw some wrenches in your plan. So as far as things I'm nervous about, hmm, I think it's just the unexpected because I know what's going to happen. It's just about what's going to happen. So fingers crossed. Leeches, eh, okay. Um, toilet conditions. Toilet conditions. <laughs> yeah, I'll be, uh, there's no toilets, you know, <laughs> and there will be some leaves, not so many, much toilet paper. <laughs> but hey, that's being in the jungle for you. So I will give a full report though once I'm back, take lots of photos and maybe some video as well so I can share with everyone. And we look forward to that when you come back. Thank you. Thank you.